and back to my misery. Oh boy. I like how I got stuck in the tutorial map, basically. <clears throat> Most of it is my mistake, but I feel if I went back here after I leveled up somewhere or got some better gear, it would be much easier. Well, let's try it again. I'll try to be more focused this time. I'll just heal because I am a bit um, paranoid about this. This guy looks dangerous. Maybe I should uh, use my mage. Fuck! The auto lock just decided to stop working. So what's up with the chariot? Are we done with it? It's not here anymore. I'm kind of concerned because it might be a, some kind of a trick. Uh, sword. Yep, it was a trick. Fuck you. Uh. <laughs> no! Fuck! This is insane. <laughs> oh, I'm so not prepared for this. God damn it! Uh, who's this boy? A wolfman. Fighter of the catman. Champion of the furies. Uh, 
this shit again. Like, I knew it was a trick. And they still just killed me because I can't fight for shit. Also curious to if I could go back to that place with, with fire. Is that the only way to to get there? Is through jumping or no? I also want to just heal up again. The slither of health could ha could actually play a big role. Oh, thank, thank you, Cherry. Nope. Stop. Oh. Even his kick takes away so much health. Comparatively. So now he just here. Even though before he wasn't. I think the game just kind of glitched. So where am I supposed to go? Um, if, if let's say I, I run forward, it's like three of them. Oh my god. Okay, that was much easier. Uh, I don't see where I could run, but I guess let's just YOLO again. Is that a boss battle? There's this statue that should revive me somewhere. Is there anything else? Can't really see it. <sighs> Really don't want to die. Okay. Dragon. Oh god. Oh boy. I'm almost dead. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> um... 
Yeah, I think... I think this was a mistake. Um... <laughs> I don't think I'm ready. Um... Let's try it two more times and just go finish the tutorial. <laughs> It just grabbed me and I'm dead. Can't even see what it's doing. <laughs> yeah, lost all souls, whatever, let's just um, continue <laughs> the tutorial. Oh. Fuck, I, I lost so much souls. I, I don't really care that much that I lost them. Uh, just because I lost them, but there is a system in uh, Dark Souls that basically remembers how much souls you acquired, and based on that, it uh, puts you with different kinds of people in in PvP, for example. That's that's what concerns me, because like basically losing souls means that I will be weaker versus uh, playing versus somebody. Or if Invader gets to me, he will be stronger. I guess slightly, it's it's not too much, but still. Whatever. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, just uh, for summoning elevator, I guess. Nothing here. Yeah, I can't even pull it. I bet it's going to be that first m mini boss we uh, we died to, right? And that item that I saw in the cave of knowledge, uh, probably going to be the item I'll pick up. A horse. I'll pick up after defeating the boss. Oh. But... Huh? Okay, maybe I was wrong. That's for crafting. In every corner of the lands between, you will find uh, fruits and flowers, mushrooms and butterflies, and various other useful materials. <sighs> These materials can be used for item crafting. A row of fruit. Um. All the fingers I have easily found everywhere in the lands between. Material used for crafting items. Oh, so I think the previous comment about capacity meant just this. Like if you have one out of 90, 999. Maybe. Mm. Still want to defeat that boss. I hope I will get back to him at some point. A lot of 
gorgeous trees in the distance. Come back here. <laughs> oh, I can actually hunt them down. Um. Thin beast bones, I guess from crafting. Yeah, that's weird. Found by hunting birds, hunting beasts. This I, I found in that tomb. Grave glove word. Strengthen ashes to plus one. Ashes? Huh? Can I just use it? What are ashes supposed to mean? My my flasks? I'll fucking use up my mana on stupid animals. <laughs> oh, there we go, and there's a bonfire. Grace exists to guide the tarnished and lead them along the proper path. Even now, some sides of Grace retain that power. Their golden rays will guide you along your way. Okay. Guides me toward the boss or another bonfire. Okay, I see. I see. Uh, use our map to check your current position as well as the terrain and surrounding structures. Uh, you can update your map uh, with new information by finding map fragments at uh, steely steels along the road. Uh, Upgrade your map. Uh, you can also use the map uh, to freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks as you explore. Hello. Oh yes, Tarnish we? Come to the lands between for the Elden Ring. Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, maidenless? without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. Well, jokes on you, I can't die. <laughs> Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless. Me, Vare. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? The golden light that gives life to you, Tarnish. You may also behold its golden rays pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace, the path that a tarnished must travel. Hmm, indeed. Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow, even if it leads you to your grave. Has modern boots, or at least they look like the boots you could wear in our period of time. Grace's guidance will reveal the path forward, most certainly, to Castle Stormvale. 
over on the cliff. The home of the decrepit demigod, Godric the Grafted. They already killed some Godric. It's time you set off, I should think. To Castle Stormvale on the cliff, where Grace would guide you. If you seek the Elden Ring, maidenless as you are. <laughs> it's time you set off, I should think. To Castle if you seek. You have to become, become maidenful first. Have to get laid. Okay, what if I... Because I do want to come back to that place. Uh, marker. Mm, this... Uh, oh, I can't, can't name it myself. Well, okay. What about beacons? How do you place beacon? Oh, A. We. Did I get my mana back? No. Well, I'm not even sure if I need to kill those beasts or gather these things. Seems kind of pointless, to be honest. This game mechanic that's very outdated. It's a MMORPG, basically. Uh, in each area, you may find effigies of martyrs. These effigies are summon summoning pools. You'll find it easy to summon other players at these locations, as co-op and hostile summoning signs created with small effigies gather at summoning pools. Huh. Yeah, because it's more open world, I guess it would be harder for people to uh, <laughs> to look for for the signs, and it has to be a place where small golden effigy. It is easier. What about the item? Sends a co-op sign to summoning pools. What? Okay. Now functional. Is there weather change? Nice. Is this horse aggressive? Teacher. Oh, that's a skull. I thought it was a mushroom. Hello? Maybe we friends? No. Jesus! <laughs> Can I kill some easier? <laughs> Enemies first? <laughs> God damn it. Oh. I just want to level up.
burst, please. <laughs> yeah, let's avoid this guy for now. Get back here. What the hell? <laughs> nice trick. Didn't help you though. No loot. Hmm. Horseless, maidenless, tarnished. Is there anything this way? I don't even care. Hunting as a wizard seems to be very uh, easy. I can go. No. Hmm. This map looks just like dog shit. <laughs> I hope it's going to change. What's this? Oh, NPC probably. Oh, that's pointing me in the direction of a boss, I assume. Herd leaf flower. Oh, okay, there are descriptions for it. A uh, dusky yellow flower that has started to fade to brown, found throughout the lands between. Material used for crafting items, said to be fed by leaves that fell from the earth tree in days of antiquity. Better like red fruits that grow in shrubs. Easily found everywhere in the lands between, it uh, has a wide variety of uses. Disposable weapons, I guess for arrows. Whoa, that's literally a giant from now. <laughs> Dark Souls, come on. You're not even trying, Miyazaki. What the fuck? Yeah, just face is not a hole. Everything else is the same. I don't want to fight these big <laughs> enemies right now. Give me just zombies, please. Good thing I can sneak now. He seems to be the um, slower, maybe. Jeez, what the fuck is that? Made of out of parasites of some sort. 
Hello, friend. So if items just go into the chest automatically, if you are full of them, there's no point putting anything in a chest, because it will go there anyway. There's no point of like sorting your items. Shrooms. A fungal growth that thrives in uh, damp thickets, thickets and uh, elsewhere. Its thick, spongy flesh makes it a key component in throwing pots. Hmm. I wouldn't mind crafting some bombs. At least uh, in the beginning. Until I get some better magics. Yeah, I hope my joystick will serve me until the end of this playthrough because it looks very uh, r rickety. The wires are sticking out. It's very dusty. What are those runes? I feel like there is something I don't see because of the draw distance. Or maybe it's supposed to be this way. attacking and then let there be precious item okay I need to get used to holding both hands fuck I hear it. I could use my uh, area of effect magic, maybe. That could help. Oh. Adding skills. With a whetstone knife, you can use ashes of war to grant your armaments new skills at sides of grace. Uh, an Armaments can only have one skill. Any skill it previously had will be removed. An armaments type determines what skills it can have. Some special armaments have unique skills and cannot be granted new ones. Uh, adding affinities. With the whetstone knife you can use ashes of war to grant Affinities to your armaments at Sides of Grace. This way you can alter the armaments attack affinity, boost attribute scaling, and more. An armaments type determines what affinities it can have. Some special armaments, like those with unique skills, cannot be granted new affinities. Ash of Wars Tomb. But, uh, okay, we'll see. <laughs> Die.
as shitty <laughs> wood prints. On sand. I don't know, I guess I'm just um, expecting much more from a game in 2021. I mean, 22. Yeah, it's February 22. Should I fuck with it? Fuck your children. You mad about it? What do you think about that? Kind of just auto aims on me. I can't. I want to get behind it, but it's it's kind of hard. Ugh. Jesus! <laughs> what do I do? Oh my god. Barely does anything. Maybe I have to aim for the head? That's the trick. <sighs> no, not really. Magic worked pretty well, but kind of want to. Whoa! Huh, that's cool. So you can cat tentacles. Yeah, I think it, it is better. Oh. It does, does more damage to the head. It's, it's still not, not that much damage, but better. It's a funny uh, monster. Vanquishing an enemy group will replenish your flasks. Uh, the number and type of flasks to be replenished varies depending on the enemy group. You cannot replenish more flasks 
than your maximum amount allows. Okay. Land octopus ovary. And strip of white flesh. Thin strips of flesh taken from a bloodless creature. Material used for crafting items. The dried meat toughness toughens the constitution, boosting resistance. It's uh, known for its long lasting effect. Puffy milky white ovary of a uh, land octopus. Land octopuses eat humans in order to bear young, and theirs is uh, the blood that uh, runs through these ovaries. Ugh. Why is this skull shiny? Ah! One soul! Am I getting this correctly? Is this just one soul? How much souls did I get from that? Wow, that's not much at all. Like, I've been going through these guards in the tomb, getting much more. <laughs> okay, let's let's actually see. I want to test it out. Um, so, Golden Rune 1. Is it just going to give me one? No, that's 200. Huh? So each golden rune is 200? And this is supposed to be 1000, right? <sighs> we should just set the, the amount of runes. I wonder if they come back, because <laughs> if they do, it's kind of fucking hilarious that I can just farm souls like that. Man, that's that's a different vi vibe from the <laughs> game. Than going uh, through Dark Souls, it's you're just kind of roaming through a map instead of um, going through it for some kind of achievement, like a, up to a boss. Well, I could try. Another one of these. God damn it. Wow. Ah, oh, fuck me. 
Oh boy. Yeah, it's much more aggressive when you're further away. <laughs> but yeah, um, I do have mana flasks. I might as well just kill it this way. less trouble. And it replenishes a nice amount of uh, runes too. Was this skull here before? Or did it just pop because of uh, the octopus? Hmm. There are petals that falling from the tree. I just noticed that they look like embers. What if I go... Uh, I guess I'll just fall <laughs> like an old Dark Souls, right? Hmm. There is no punishment for dying except you might lose souls if you is that? No, that's just a player. A defendless creature that can't fight back? I hope you are. My stamina doesn't even uh, go down. Weird. Turtleneck meat. More white flesh. Some dude on the beach there. Um. A splendid, lengthy cut of turtleneck meat. Uh, material user considered an especially nu nutritious ingredient in the south of the land between why in with a capital I just to put emphasis on it or what Ooh, those goblins My spells didn't even rage. Well, there's no point sneaking up to them. Let's see what you get. You basically replenish everything as you fight these creatures. It's not like you have a limited amount of um, f health or flasks, I guess, until the next bonfire. Maybe you will have that at certain points or like dungeons. Other island here. Wait, what? There's a cave? Oh, I missed. Good thing it showed. Time for friend. 
there going to be bonfire or should I go back? I don't even have level up. That's the problem. Because I want to spend, spend my souls, so I won't lose them. Before I going on crazy adventures, you know? Can I level up at the bonfires? Because I don't... I'm not sure. Maybe I should con continue on the main path first, and then I'll c come back here. Uh, fuck, but it's also so curious. What's uh, in this fucking cave? Hmm. More goblins, probably. What is this anti buff in there? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I need to get to the point of the game where I can level up, otherwise I will just lose a lot of souls and be very mad about it. Okay, uh, let's teleport to the... can teleport? But there is the, the sight of grace. <laughs> Okay. I guess I have to work. Yeah, it is it is going to be much wiser to get to that point first. I think Sec. Break in the recording.